I do love horsing around in a stable environment. And so do these guys. <laughs> so we're going to make them one. A stable, classic design. A couple of stalls, a pen and a roof. Really easy to make. You can get the exact dimensions for it out of my book. Now, take your average handsaw, it might just surprise you. A lot of them these days have a square built into the handle. Helps for marking up stuff like this. I'm using seven millimetre thick ply for this. Your stable really can be any size. You just want to make sure that it suits the size of the animals that you've got at home. A handsaw will make pretty short work of it. It has certainly drawn some attention already. Back off, fellas. I've got to cut some posts and then the real fun starts. Assembly. The posts are just out of 11 by 11 millimetre finger jointed pine. You can pick that up readily enough at the moulding section of your hardware store. Once you have cut your post to length, it's time to start gluing. The big tip here is to use two different glues. You use a PVA glue, which has a really strong long-term bond, and a hot glue, which sets really quickly, giving you an instant bond that holds things in position until the PVA dries. You can see I'm leaving gaps in the PVA line. That's where I apply hot glue. The back goes against the base first, and then one end. How good is that so far? No nails, no screws, and it's holding together beautifully. Then glue and place the other end, keeping it open and breezy. A support beam for the roof and the stalls. Remember, it's the animals you have at home that determine the size of your stable. The roof is removable and sits on top. Oh yes. The PVA glue is not even close to dry, but it is still a very stable stable thanks to the hot glue. Oh, the animals are bound to be getting excited by now. One thing is for certain, the kids are going to have a ball with it. Now to take a leaf out of the good farming book, thou shalt not waste a thing. A couple of stall doors, a feed box, and even a shovel. Out of a 600 by 450 millimetre sheet of ply, that is all that's left. That's good farming. If you do like the stable, give it a thumbs up. If not, thumbs down. And subscribe for regular DIY fun and tips for maintenance at your place. G'day. I've written a book. It's called How to Build a Billy Cart and Other Fun Stuff. It's in all good bookstores across Australia. If you think you might like a copy, give this bit a thumbs up. <laughs>